it's uh, Ron here. Um, I'm out back here at the beach here in beautiful Margate City, New Jersey. I'm doing a uh, update here uh, or a test flight here of the uh, Scotty O2. Uh, it just got new. Um, just got new uh, software. They don't say firmware; they say software. And this is not uh, the app. Uh, this is, um, you know, the actual uh, stuff on the drone. There now. Uh, I'll put the version number of the new software d down below here. I, I'm in the. I've walked in the picture now, so I'll put it down below. Um, we currently have our settings at uh, 4K uh, 60. Uh, our shutter speed at 120. Uh, and our ISO at 100. So we have our proper uh, balance of, uh, you know, uh, shutter and frame rate. So uh, I will press this little button here on the uh, thingamajiggy here, and it, we will we will let it follow me out to the beach here. All righty. We're going to walk up here to the uh, top of the dune here. It's a, it's a beautiful Sunday, Sunday afternoon here. Um... Not much wind it's still cold it's probably in the low 40s but uh with no wind it makes it feel good down here in all this bright sunlight here uh these dunes they were um there were you didn't used to be dunes here in margate city they just put these dunes up a few years ago i'm gonna adjust the um camera here a little bit let me get this on my right side and then maybe you'll get a little more sunlight here and uh, you always have to walk here before this adjusts okay now it's going to go over to my right give me a little bit better maybe sunlight here yeah we were kind of in the shadows there you go so that's a much better of view and let's go a little bit higher here i'm using the um combination of the phone and the um remote control or the paranafi style remote control you can get with it it's uh it's an extra added feature here for the Scotty O2 drone, um, and uh, yeah, they always had a beacon, but I'm not. You can hear the thing buzzing around me. I'm not using the beacon uh, today. You know what? I don't fly this enough, and I always forget how to um, do everything on the beacon. <laughs> so I got to relearn the beacon here. What if I could adjust this uh, a little bit around here? I want to change it, y'all. I forgot it won't let me fly this while I'm in tracking mode. I want to take it out of tracking mode a little bit here. To kind of give you a fly here and give you a view here. Let's go up a little bit higher here. We'll raise the gimbal a little bit. There you go. Look at that beautiful GoPro style color on this thing here. Let me just set it down at beach a little bit here. There you go. Big wide beach down here today. They replenished this beach just recently. Kind of the end of Vetner. Yeah, it used to be real thin. All right, some people head on the beach here. I'm at about a thousand feet here. Somebody walk on the beach. So I will not fly over them for safety's sake. We will um, come back now. So that was a thousand, got a perfect signal here. Now I talked about um you know buying accessories for the um Scuddy O2, and I noticed recently that the uh the dual battery charger is sold out on on the uh, Scuddy O website right now, and I don't think there's an option for uh, buying it. So um that's unfortunate, but uh, I will let you know if that comes back in stock. Okay. We're, we're going down here about 20. 23. I'm not doing a screenshot here, but uh, I'll read them off to you. I'm in, the, I'm in the low 20s here coming back towards me. So it's easily within sight here. So let's, uh, walk, let's walk around down here at the beach a little bit here. Let's aim it back to us and see if we can get a little, see if we can fight that, uh, that bright sunlight. going to be sunset here in, uh, you know, half hour or so. There we go. That looks pretty good there. So let's fly this thing down here. I kind of walk towards it. Nobody down here at this end. So that's kind of nice. I don't have the HDR feature turned on here. 
because I can't adjust all my frame rates and stuff if I do. So, yeah, I, I don't know if there's any, you know, any extra um, doodads or anything in the uh, software here with this, um, that update. Uh, I think it just said, you know, general bug fixes, it makes it fly better. So that's pretty generic, but, uh, you know, flying better is always a good thing, you know, uh, right? So, uh, let me bring that back towards me now. Bring it down and closer. Now we're dealing with a lot of shadows here. I could light this up, but I want to keep that frame rate correct. See if I, how, how much I have to walk by before it sees me. There we go. I put the little blue dot in the screen. Now it can see me and follow me. That's going to follow me. Follow me to the right, but you got to move before it makes its turn. You know, a lot of people don't know that you have to actually, you know, make the turn before it follows you. So, hi, Skydio. Yeah, it, it's performing with this update. It's performing well, just as good as ever. We're in motion track mode right now, which is, uh, no drone is easier to, um, you know, pull up the motion track than the Scudio 2 because it just, as soon as it sees something, it offers to you. You don't have to dig down any menus looking for it. So that's a really good thing. Let me put this kind of in front of me a little bit more. See how that looks. It'll adjust here in a second. Okay, I have it filed me front right. So, it's got its back to the sun now, and it's facing me. So again, how does this frame rate look here? This beautiful 4K60. I'm walking towards the uh, Margate Fishing Pier, which you saw in the uh, wide shot earlier. Alrighty. Okay, I'm walking over this thing. There's like a little metal pole here. I wonder if it sees the metal pole. All right, still trying to stay my my front right screen here because I'm not walking too fast. So it's only doing like three, four miles per hour. We're almost down to the water here. Yeah, we're almost down to the water. We're getting the shadow here, so I'm gonna. Now that I can see again that the sun's not in my eye, I'm going to turn motion track off. Let's see if we can fly manual here. There you go. You can see that fishing pier. Look at those nice shadows. Wonder if I could fly through that fishing pier. I sure can. We're on the other side. And we'll go up. out of here home run mickey morandini get some height there now we're really we're really gaining some height we're 150 160 feet high so there you go see that sunset there so we're still in our 60 frames per second 4k Should be kind of right over me now, I think. We're kind of really high now, so let's get let's get lower here. Let's 
to kind of a semi-circle around the semi-orbit around the Margate Fishing Pier. Okay, that looks pretty cool. Okay, what's uh for 45% battery life, so let's start walking back. Uh, let's see if we can bring it a little bit closer to us. <laughs> 